Hello friends, welcome to Yelanga Notes. In this tutorial, you will learn how to use lolcat command in Linux. Okay, so watch this video fully for clear understanding. Now we will move to video. So lolcat is actually new command in Linux and other Unix flavor. Uh, like cat command, it support all the features of the cat command. Unlike cat command, it support two new features. Number one is by default, it will show the output in rainbow colors. Okay. The cat command will simply show the content without rainbow colors. This is one of the feature. And another one is unlike cat command, this command can be used to show the text animation using the special options A and D. Okay. So this is the two new features of the lolcat command. Okay. And here you can find the five examples of the lolcat command. Number one is creating a file. Number two is displaying the contents of file. Number three is text opening into file. Number fourth one is merging multiple files into a single file. Number fifth one is creating a text animation. Now we will see the operations one by one. First one is creating a file. Like cat command, this command can be used to create a text file in the Linux OS uh, using the output redirection operator greater than symbol. The syntax is it follows the same style of the cat command. So lolcat space greater than and your file name so here the file name is user defined so you can give any file name with or without a txt extension so this is a sample example lolcat followed by greater than symbol and followed by the id after that you need to type the input once your inputs are complete then simply press ctrl c from your keyboard after that you can see the file using lolcat space file name dot txt so this is the example for first one now I will show the example. So uh, and another important point is that it is a latest Linux command. So by default uh, this command is not installed in every machine. So first you need to install this command based on your distribution. Uh, after uh, Once you install then you can use the all operations of lolcat command. Now I will show the demo lolcat followed by After that, you can type some input. Once your input is over, then simply press Ctrl C from keyboard. After that, simply type lolcat followed by your file name. Okay, now the contents uh, by default will be shown in the rainbow colors. So every time the colors will be changed. Okay. So this is the first example and the second one is displaying the contents of file like can command this command can also use to display the contents of single file as well as multiple files. Additionally this command is also used to show the file contents using the input redirection operator less than symbol. So less than indicates getting the input from file and greater than symbol means uh, the message should be written in the file. So this is the difference between less than and greater than. So the syntax is it follows exactly the same syntax as cat command lolcat followed by single file name and here lolcat followed by multiple file files. So this is a sample example. So first one is showing the output of single file and the second one is showing the output of contents of the multiple files. Now I will show the demo. So simply first I am showing the single file. Now I am showing the multiple file so here I have submitted three files so it will show the contents of three files additionally you can use a less than symbol okay so the less than symbol is optional okay The third one is text append into file. So like cat command, this command can also use to add your text message at the end of your uh, old input file. So this is done with the help of the append operator double greater than symbol. So here the input should be an existing file name. Otherwise it will create a new file. So the syntax is lolcat double greater than and old file. So this is a sample file. So after that lolcat just to type double greater than and followed by your old input file and this is the new content. So once the contents are over simply press ctrl c from your keyboard. 
after that you can see the new updates at the end of the file content okay now i will show the real demo first let us take the sample file so here i need to append some content after that you simply press control c from keyboard now you can see that you you can see the update update result so before the update first two lines are displayed so after the updates the last two lines are added to the end of the file so this is the difference of up and file okay so in this way you can create a up and mode the next one is merging multiple files into a single file so like cat command this command can also used to support the multiple files into a single file so this is done with the help of the uh, single greater than symbol that is output reduction operator so here you need to provide minimum two files for merging files if you are giving single file it will be considered as a normal file creation so minimum you need to attach two files for the merging process the syntax is lol cat followed by file 1 file 2 up to file n and followed by greater than symbol followed by your target file name so this is user defined so you can give any name so here consider uh, this is the file 1 and this is the file 2 and this is the file 3 and finally apply the merging process lolcat followed by your input files and greater than symbol and your target file ok now i will show the demo this is the first file this is the second file this is the third file this is the fourth file now i need to merge these four files into single file now all the files are merged into new file j4.txt so just type lolcat j4.px so here you can see the this is the content of first file and this is the content of second file and this is the content of third file or fourth file this is the content of third file and this is the content of fourth file so the contents of all the four files are stored in the single file j4.txt for every operation of the lolcat command and the default rainbow colors will be shown so this is the difference between cat and lolcat command then fifth one is creating a text animation normally cat command will not be used for text animation so if you want to uh, blink the text in the linux terminal you can use the lolcat command so this lolcat command can be used to create a text animation in the terminal this is done with the help of the special option option a and option d follow the seconds when option a indicates animation option d indicates the duration in the seconds so this is a syntax for showing the text animation we need a text message so in the linux the text message can be displayed using two ways one is echo command second one is a print command so you can use any command echo or print command so echo followed by your message and after that this process is done with the help of the piping process because pipe only is to join two or more number of commands okay so the output of the echo message will be given as a input to the lolcat command so if you are giving direct message to lolcat will not be supported okay so that we are using pipe command the um, pipe command the aim of the pipe command is to uh, send the output of one command that is output of the first command to input of the second command okay after that type lolcat and followed by a that is animation and followed by d then number of seconds to blink so the duration is seconds okay 200 seconds so this is the output now i will show the real demo just type lolcat just type echo followed by your message welcome linux followed by 
pipe on followed by lolcat and use option a for animation and options space uh, followed by b and space followed by number of seconds so here i am giving 400 seconds now you can see the animations effect so up to 400 seconds it will show the animations welcome to linux programming so it will show the animations in the different rainbow colors So this is the main important features of the lolcat command. Now the time seconds are how? So this is the most important features of the lolcat command. And this is the difference between cat and the lolcat command. The first one is cat is most widely used popular command and it is default installing your machine. And lolcat is the latest command in Linux. So you need to install it externally. And the second difference is the cat command show the file contents with the line number using the special option n and lolcat command will not show the file content with the line number this is one of the drawback but lolcat command will show the output of the file but it will not show the line number and third one is cat command will not show the output in rainbow colors by default the lolcat command will show the output in rainbow colors in the terminal this is the third and cat command will not be used for creating a text animation and the lolcat command is popular for creating the text animations so this is the difference between cat and lolcat so here you have learned five important features of lolcat command so if you like this video please subscribe and like our channel and please give your, please give your suggestion thank you